Hey there. How are you? I'm doing fine. Thanks for asking. Welcome to Grey Plague. We're going to be playing at Grey Plague. It's a very interesting kind of visual novel thing. So let's go. Question mark. Year 2020. The day that everything changed. Z, 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 triple Z. Ring, ring. Uh, what? Let's pick up the phone. Uh, hello? This is Red. Hello, sweetie. What the? Mom? How's your day? Why is mom calling? She never wants to do that. She never wants to chat. I can't read. Besides, she should be working at the hospital right now. What do you want? Yes, okay, okay. Well, I didn't actually call to chit chat. Get me some breakfast, would you? My academic conference is at the hospital. At the hospital. And my academic conference at the hospital is going on a little long. Uh, reading. As interested as 3D printed organs are, I can't focus with a grumbling stomach. <sighs> yeah, anything else? Ooh, get hummus with pita bread. Good stuff, Red. Fine. Also, visit your grandma. I do it myself, but I'm just too busy. Well, there goes my Saturday. The last I heard from her was months ago. Her voice was hoarse, and there's an, an unusual sickness going around. So, I just wonder. There is an unusual sickness? Sweetheart, did you not know? Know what? A new disease has been spreading rapidly in the past few months. It's nicknamed the Grey Plague for how it grays your skin. I love this soundtrack, by the way. It's great. Grey Plague might be mutated tu tuberculosis, which is one of the most deadly diseases. The victims of the the victims of Grey Plague at my hospital are already showing the usual symptoms of tuberculosis. For some, their, their lungs are riddled with holes. And the worst cases, well, riddled with holes, huh? That sounds terrifying. <laughs> what about the worst cases? Well, for those with higher amounts of gray plague bacteria and weaker immune systems. Yeah, how does, how does she not, how does Red not know? what she's hinting at. Obviously, they, they're dead. Their lungs are almost completely gone by captivation. Cavi cavitation. And without both lungs, they can't get oxygen. They'll die. Believe it or not. It can't get, it, it can't get worse, right? Well... It's rare, but Great Plague can cavitate other organs too. The liver, the kidneys, even the heart. Can it be cured? We don't know. If Great Plague's just another form of tuberculosis, can you cure Great Plague with tuberculosis medication? That exists, right? Yes, but Grey Plague mutated so that existed tuberculosis treating doesn't work on it. That's why, if tuberculosis used to be the number one most deadliest disease, Grey Plague is even more so. How does that even work? Ooh, mouse over for mouse over anatomy for more info. That sounds cool. Oh. Those are the lungs, they give oxygen to blood cells. 
That's the heart. And, well, the process is quite elaborate. Maybe if you visualize it, you'll understand better. I mean, that's what I'm doing now. Imagine you're a tuberculosis bacteria. Uh, okay. Hush, imagine. Oh my god. A person with gray plague just uh, a person with gray plague just sneezed. Yes. You start your journey in front of that person in a droplet that came out of that sneeze. That sounds gross. Travel through the air to find an uninfected person's mouth and infect them. Don't you just hate it when people sneeze inside of your mouth? Mouths. Oh my god. Oh my! Oh, I have to find another mouth. Let me let me get in there. Let me. Can I? Can I? I thought I'm supposed to go inside their mouth. How do I get inside their mouth? Oh, let me get inside your eye then. Maybe not. Where else do I go then? Can I go down here? No, they want me to go inside their mouth. I'm literally... Was I not just by their mouth? Should I just stay here? This is worrying me. Do I go back inside my bubble? Oh, wait. Ooh, I can push this. But do I want to push it to their mouth? Not sure if I do. Oh, don't leave, please. Please. You need to be eaten. an idiot, right? This is what I'm supposed to be doing. Right? Hope I'm not stupid. Okay, this is not what I'm supposed to be doing. Let me stop wasting time. Let's go this way. Then we'll find another person, I'm sure. Someone better. A tall guy with very nice eyes and very nice hair. Let's go inside his mouth. Yes. I'm, why did it zoom? Okay. Oh my god, this is cool. This is so cool. Oh man, which hole do I go down? I don't wanna... So you know, I should probably go inside of his lungs. Oh, I can't go there, okay. He has to eat me. That's the eat pipe, right? After descending the trachea, you come upon two branching paths. The left bronchus and the right bronchus of the lungs. Which will you choose? Oh man. Dang, I gotta go. I gotta go right. I gotta go right. Oh boy, this is a maze. Zing. Hey -o. Hey, do I go to these? They want me to do that? I guess not. What do you want from me, game? I guess we're going to the down. Let's go. Oh. The TB bacteria should go... The TB bacteria should go to an... Alveol alveolus in the upper half of the lungs. There's more oxygen there. Was I not just there? I think I. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is not how you bacteria. At least this is like. Uh. Practical. Oh. What is that? Something to eat? Looks like you've encountered a white blood cell. 
I forgot to mention, but the immune system of your host might start sending white blood cells to destroy you. Avoid them and good luck. Thanks, Mom. Oh, okay, wait, I'm avoiding them. Shoot, shoot. Oh no, shoot. What? Do they chase me? Are they chasing me? Okay, they are, but loosely, aren't they? Am I supposed to get to here? Wow, my god. No, please. Please. Please, you have to listen to me. Please. 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 Oh. Oh. What? What do you want me to do? Just tell me what you want me to do. You want me to get to the, oh, to the very top? This game doesn't give me any instructions. Oh no, please. Please. What? Go to the higher part. Just kidding. Okay, okay, okay. Evade, 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 evade. Okay, should I go down here? East? Okay, never mind. Can I go up here then? Is that where they want me to go? Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Okay, I'm good. I'm great. I feel fantastic. Go to the upper part, they said. It'll be fun, they said. Come on, I'm literally up the Oh. I am an idiot. Okay. So now I'm here. Let's go this way. Oh, I've arrived at an Avelos with lots of oxygen. You divide into more bacterium to infest your host further. Yeah. Yes, we're dividing. We're di uh oh, watch out! White blood cells have found out where you're, where you are, and are heading your way. And they can't do anything to me. Oh, these follow me loosely. I mean, I don't see any white blood cells anywhere, honestly. Oh no, oh they are here. Ah Too bad. For now your journey ends here. You got engulfed by a white blood cell. But because tuberculosis, or I guess TB bacteria, contain a special protein that blocks white blood cells enzymes, you don't get digested. Once the immune system realizes the TB bacteria are still alive, the bacteria get attacked with, with white blood cells and phagocytes, phagocytes, over and over again. The layers of immune cells start forming like a sphere, a shape called a granuloma. <laughs> granuloma. The granuloma gets larger and larger. Oh, geez, that looks weird, doesn't it? <clears throat> Eventually, it calcifies into a hard white mass visible in x-rays. Oh, yeah, my, mo my mom is a doctor, isn't she? Uh, yeah, that's cool. My mom is such a great doctor that she can show me so hands-on. Someone getting infected. This is where cavitation comes in. Ooh, science. Remember, the TB bacteria survive all this because they have a special protein. Yes, we learned that in the last two texts. Sometimes the surviving TB bacteria can duplicate rapidly inside the calcified granuloma and burst out. Boom. 
and thus that process had started all over again. So was I supposed to die? I think I was supposed to die. TB travels other to other Avalori. Avalori gets destroyed by Granny Loma. Granny Loma calcifies. Granny Loma bursts. The lungs get destroyed. There we, there we go, sweetie. Cavitation. You're right. That is an elaborate process. Stay safe, sweetheart. Don't inhale near people, near those who sneeze. Mom doesn't know about my powers. Let's just say I'm basically immune to disease. Yes, of course. I don't want to still talk to her, but okay. Grandma? Wait, what's wrong with Grandma? Oh dear. Well, last I heard from her, she sounded hoarse and kept coughing. You know, she might have an infection. What if- what infection? I'm not sure. I hope she's alright. Then why don't you go visit her yourself? Is she gonna say, oh, I'm, I'm so busy. My life is so hard. I said I'm busy. I knew it. What are you learning about in your academic session? And what are you learning about in your academic session? 3D printed organs? Before I tell you, do you know what 3D printing is? I do know what 3D printing is. It's when you print things made out of uh, stuff and you can put it in people and it works. Now they have organs that people made. So yes, we do. So every few months, my hospital holds an academic conference. Professionals all, around, all over the world come to attend. During it, we learn about the latest medical innovations. Oh. Today, the conference is all hullabaloo about one of the most exciting innovations yet. 3D printed organs. Did we not just talk? What? Okay, never mind. If humankind could make organs out of thin air, think of the possibilities. Oh, is that a nose? Is that a potato? Is that a woman making a potato? She looks very tired. Either very tired or very Asian. We could transplant organs and other body parts without needing donors. We could save so many lives. The heck is this? Is that a needle? We could even, maybe, print a whole human. Okay. Of course, the technology behind it all has limitations. It's quite expensive, and we can print complicated organs, like intestines, liver, the brain. Are intestines really that complicated? Aren't they just tubes inside of your belly? Just really compressed like a, like a, like a compressed thing? Maybe 3D print, oh wait, that's me. That's me, red. Maybe 3D printed organs could somehow save, could somehow help the victims of Grey Plague. Yeah, because they can get their lungs, right? <laughs> Bye. That's great. Look at the time. I need to hurry back. Don't talk to strangers. Be careful on your way to Grandma's. You know she doesn't live in the nicest part of town. Bye, sweetie. Click. Dot, dot, dot. The apartment. Hey, we're in the apartment. There's a drawer. My drawer. Let's open the first drawer. I keep my physical cash here. Not the safest hiding spot. Oh well. Oh wow, we just got money. We got paid. My drawer, again. Let's open the second drawer. My clothes. And my favorite red coat. Might as well get dressed then. Whoa, she's wearing a red coat now. I'm missing something. What am I missing? Please tell me. I guess we'll click... Me! Oh wait, what's this? To view out my window. 
So we can look at those or actually go there. And I'm gonna go there, yeah? Okay, let's look at it. It's the wholesale store. Probably my mom's probably will probably will buy, buy my mom's breakfast there. Let's look at the hospital. It's far. I'll have to take the cramped city bus to get there. Fun. Let's stop looking. I hate outside. My mom worries about me getting gray plague, but I've never gotten sick. Not once. And then there's this curse I have. I've only told my grandma and my best friend about my powers. Let's examine my hands. Of course. It's weird. If I want to, I can see people's organs, their bones, their muscles. I can even see mine. Let's examine my bones. Now, oh, a mouse over anatomy. Oh, look at that. When I'm bored, sometimes I just stare at my hand bones. Oh, that's cool. Those are your carpals. Those are your phalanges. And those are your metacarpals. This staring has taught me that my hands made of three types of bones. Phalanges in my fingers, metacarpals in my palm, and carpals at my wrist. Okay. I have bones everywhere. Wow. Welcome to the club. One day, I was so bored that I counted them all. 206 in total, I think. Wow, looks like you're an adult. All blood cells are made all blood cells are made in bone and all blood cells are made in the bones too. Without bones, I'd be some sh sort of shapeless, bloodless jelly. Would you really be jelly? Are you sure you wouldn't just be like hollow? It wouldn't just be skin? I don't think you'd be jelly. I doubt you would because because the blood would kind of, I don't know. Hmm, freaky. How do, you, how do you think this is freaky? You've probably been seeing this since birth. Been able to see this since birth. Mom told me that there's three types of muscles. These hand muscles are skeletal muscles because they're attached to my skeleton. Wow. I hope grandma's house... Ha oh my god. I hope grandma's heart... Her cardiac muscle. Let me read that again. I hope grandma's heart... Her cardiac muscle... Is beating healthily. Let's go back. I don't like to look at my hand. Let's examine my thoughts. It's insane. What? They never talked about this. You see people's nervous system. That's, you should probably probably become a doctor. That'd be nice. It's insane. When I focus, I can see people's nervous systems. Signals firing from new neuron to neuron. Blinking like a bunch of Christmas lights. That's weird. Some What? Sometimes I can read people's minds from the way their neurons fire. Are you sure? This is becoming more like and more far-fetched i understand okay i have x-ray vision then oh but i can also read people's minds on occasion <laughs> i don't want to fine let's just see what this is mental nervous system blah, 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 blah. feeling spinal cord like the greek messenger god hermes my headless chicken oh that's interesting actually Chicken can't do much thinking without the brain, it's all. The brain is really, oh. Okay, okay, I get it, 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 I get it. Oh, no, shoot. I didn't mean to click again. Oh, that's cool, that's cool, that's cool. Wow, wow, wow. Yeah, you should probably control your movement to get out of bed. Let's stop examining our body. Forget it. I'm stuck with this curse. Blessing. 
No, I'm stuck with this curse. Blessing? Power. It's, it's better to ignore it. To ignore it. No one has to know. Hmm. Am I normal? Or am I normal? Dot dot. dot. Am I am I normal with one dot or normal with two dots? Uh, okay. Yes, I'm normal. Dot. Dot. Okay, let's let's get out of bed. Time to go outside. What's this? Okay, that's freaky. A letter. Grandma's old fashioned. Oh, a letter. Grandma's so old fashioned. It's spotted with blood. What? How do you even send a message like this? How do you get this past whatever it's called? My dearest granddaughter. I have lost track of time. The days blur together and it is hard to breathe. There are blood spots on my clothing. The neighbors seem restless. I have a request. I hold the fondest love for you. No, I would never ask you ask this of you unless for an emergency. Please, I know you are ashamed of your ability to see through people. But if blank blank come over and blank What's going on? Grandma. Oh man, that's cool thing that she's wearing corset she was there for me when I was bullied when I was lost one of the only ones I trust with my secret I can't lose her I have to find her and and I hope everything's okay but isn't she at her house probably This is probably a long game, isn't it? Kinda of long game. This city. Look at us. We're wearing red. Our name is red. Are we little red riding hood? Not what you're trying to say. Oh, okay. Let's talk to this person. Joe, a past co-worker. Pretty friendly guy. Kindly blowing ice into the air. Achoo! Wow, gosh. Does Joe have the Grey Plague? Because only people who sneeze have the Grey Plague. Maybe we shouldn't talk to him so we don't die. Whoa, you alright? Look at look his eyes, man. Those are some nice eyes. Huh? Oh, hey, Red. Yeah, yeah. I've been feeling under the... I've, I've been feeling under the weather, but whatever. So, how's it going? Let's try to look at Joe's organs. Uh, look at that. Gosh, his lungs. Oh, they have holes in them. Why is this being weird? Oh, no. He's damaged by calcified granulomas. Oh, no. Joe's lungs. They have some cavitation. Oh, man. Josh is gonna... Is that his name? Josh is gonna die. Joe? Joe, Josh? He must have some form of tuberculosis. Maybe Grey Plague. If people don't normally have tuberculosis, it's probably the Grey Plague. No, I'm not gonna tell Joe he has a Grey Plague. What the heck? No. Joe, you'll be fine. Joe, that... Joe, say, that cough was pretty bad. I think you need to rest, or, or... What did Mom say the cure to the Great Plague was? Oh, right, there is no cure yet. Dang. Oh, jeez, I'm fine. That's his, that's his voice now. I mean, it's... <laughs> I mean, it's really painful. But I won't die from it, from whatever I got. Joe, you likely could. Just take care. Bye. See ya. Hey, let's talk to you. Girl. My best friend, Sophia. Sophia? Sophia. 
She's in love with biotechnology. She better not cough. Hey, Sophia. Hello. Oh, wait, shoot. I need to do another voice. Hello, Red. What are you doing out here? You know, getting breakfast for my mom, the usual. My saw. She was her voice. My sarcasm detector is beeping. What? Just ask. Do you have any hummus or pita bread by any chance? Because the random people on the street, well, not random, she's not random, but people on the street might be carrying hummus or pita bread. Well, that's a weird question. I do, of course. Just came out the grocery store. Cool, can I have some? What for? I'm not hungry, I don't want pita bread and hummus. Aaron for my mom. Oh, oh, okay, well, my mom requested I specifically fetch some hummus and pita bread for her. You're not your mom's maid. Uh, all right. Wow. Thank you. This is why I love you, because you give me food. How come I'm predicting everything that this game says? You love me for my food? I need better friends. <laughs> By the way, do you know about 3D printing? Do I know anything? Of course, it's all the rage in biotech. In fact, I have a 3D printer at home I fiddled around, that I fiddled around with. You can't print organs with a regular old 3D printer though, right? Unfortunately, yes. You need a bio printer to print organs. But the difference between a normal 3D printer and a bio printer is mostly in the printing material. So I'm planning on tweaking my regular printer to print organs. Why is she printing organs? Why? Please. Haha, <laughs> you're crazy. Brilliantly crazy. When the alternative is to buy a bio printer that costs upwards of $100,000, mind you, I have no other choice. Sophia is very clever. With my powers and Sophia's smarts, maybe we could devise a treatment for a gray plague. Not for the gray plague, just for gray plague. Maybe even find a cure for my grandma. Bye. Take care, Sophia. Back at your red. Yes, let's go to the bus. The Metro. Wait, who's saying this? I don't know who's saying this. Is it me? I don't think I'd be saying it. Where to? Oh, they're, they're literally telling me, asking me where I want to go. Okay, let's go. Yeah, we have to go to the poorest number for Gran... Grammy. My grandma's house is near there. Am I sure? Yeah, obviously we have to go see her. Now all I have to do is wait. Let's look around. Is that a person? They look a bit tired and and stressed. Typical rush hour riders. Best not to bother them. Let's look at this person. Okay, so we're, don't bother anyone, okay. Let's nap then. I take a nice, a nice long nap. By the time I wake up, I'm nearly there, as you can tell right here. Soon I step off the metro. And like how they disappear first. Ooh, this is cool. I like this whole handwritten and everything. Everything's good about this. I like this. I'm learning and stuff. Look at this. I shoot. We did need to do this something for our mom first. Oh, okay. Let's go backwards. Let's go backwards. 
I can look at myself. I knew it was a bad idea to let Grandma stay in Renwood. Then this neighborhood is low income and poverty is a huge risk factor for, di for diseases and tuberculosis. Very true. Grandma's at higher risk of, sim of getting gray plague simply by breathing in this neighborhood. But I need to get Mom her breakfast first. Well, Grandma, please be well. That's, that's how you know you care. Can I, can I go backwards? Please? Why can't I go back? That's the way that the bus was. Uh, uh, is this supposed to be happening? I'm sure in my I'm sure in my mic you can hear me clicking. Uh This is very weird, isn't it? It won't let me leave. Uh, good music, though. Well, all right. I guess I'll end this video here. Uh, tell me if you want to see more of this, more of this game called Grey Plague. Please leave a like. Please subscribe. Please unsubscribe. Yeah. I really just love this music. It's the best part about this. Bye.